The election of 2020 is continuing to break records, and one of those records is the number of openly LGBTQ people who were elected last week across the country. NBC News puts that number at 220, but that could continue to grow as dozens of races in the U.S. still haven't been called. Now, most of these candidates were elected at the state and local levels, but LGBTQ representation at the national level will be at its highest ever when new members of Congress take their seats next year. That includes the country's first two openly LGBTQ black members of Congress, Mondaire Jones and Richie Torres, both of New York. According to the LGBTQ Victory Fund, it's a national organization with the mission to increase the number of openly LGBTQ elected officials. 574 candidates were on the ballot this year. That is a new record. That's up from around 430 back in 2018. The biggest stories, the moment they happen from around the globe. Subscribe to Bloomberg Quick Take now for insight in an instant.